what can you offer uh, prospective students about the competence and dedication of the teacher, Richard? Oh, that's easy. That he he knows what he's talking about. He's been down this road. So you're talking to somebody and learning from somebody who has experience with the mindset that you have. Richard has certainly experienced success. He's experienced downfall, but he's come right back up. He's come right back up with a growth mindset. He is really walk to walk with this stuff. His dedication is like obviously to helping people. Like he's one of the few people that I've met that walked away from circumstances that, you know, could have paid him a lot of money. Richard has made using your brain cool again. He's just like one of the most, uh, you know, well-spoken, well-researched, engaging people out there. His grasp of the these concepts is really amazing. And like I say, really, um, his communication style is very easy. If you want to be helped and and you're putting in, you know, the time, then, you know, you don't, you can't ask for anyone else. He makes everybody feel like they have value. He presents himself with an absolute level of integrity. If it had to come down to one thing that helped me get over my hesitance to cough up the cash to join autonomy. I just knew that there was no bullshit there, that he, what he is saying, he truly believes because of the work that he has put out in the world, that is of the highest level of integrity of anyone that I've ever come across. And he demonstrates it over the course of a body of work that he's put out to the world that spans decades. And offers this wonderful course to people that, you know, want a way out of that learned helplessness through the course of autonomy, through his lectures, through his making himself available uh, for questions and answers. I mean, I couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Um, somebody that, you know, you can look, up, look at and say, hey, um, he's not Superman, but he definitely has something about him that you can you can grab onto and, and and ride the wave to success in your own way. It's just some of the qualities that, that we have in other that we have in ourselves that are dormant, you can readily see available in him. And he makes himself available to to emulate that throughout the course. If you ask a question, it makes you feel good about what you asked, even if you feel like it's really, you know, not important. And he always gives you excellent feedback and, you know, valuable information. I loved he, that he shared his story last night. The struggles and the work that's gone into his life to get to where he's at today. And, you know, everybody thinks it's just, you know, this straight line of A to B when it's this, you know, back and forth and up and down and, you know, it's a journey. And so he's earned, you know, every bit of it. And that's why he's where he's at. Yeah, I had the same experience when I when I actually heard about his story. I was just like, oh, I want to learn from this guy with the books. And then when I actually found out his whole background and his story, his journey, and the strength of character he he's d shown to get through all that stuff, it's it's mind boggling. To know somebody and to see them, just know their history and who they are and how how they grew, and from where they started, where you have a lot in common with that base, it's really exciting. So you're not alone, and this is somebody who's overcome that throughout a series of events that he put himself in these places throughout his life and he's grown substantially so this course is mainly like sales oriented um entrepreneurship there's definitely a freedom mindset but i feel like all, a lot of the work he was doing before I, I really don't believe that he was making a lot of money doing it he was just kind of putting this content out to help people <laughs> and that kind of became i think his high value content offers because like i know for me it was like oh, i trust this guy so whatever he's doing um you know, I, I believe in, like, I don't think he's going to be taking advantage of you or whatever. And, and that's what, that's what I found through going through the course. Yeah. That's a really um, good point. I think, um, particularly in the, in the context of future students, you know, if they want to get an idea of, uh, Richard, they can go listen to the peace revolution podcast, all 5,000 hours of it or whatever, yeah, <laughs> however yeah. many out there are. And, and yeah. realize that the amount of work and research and learning and reading and blood, sweat and tears that went into that. And it's just yeah. there for free for anybody as a public service. And it's, you know, somebody described it as like a PhD level education 
in and of itself. I mean, to be to offer that just freely to the public, like well, the website, the brain map, you know, mm-hmm. connecting all the dots, that takes a certain kind of person to do that. You know, just offer that. <laughs> um, you got to have just some kind of, you know, a good kind of ethic about you to do something like that. Because we, we are at a point where you're, enc- you're actively in- encouraged by the mainstream to not think. Like, there's someone smarter than you who's already thought of this, so you don't need to think anymore, thanks very much. Uh, whereas Rich is med- like, no, it's okay to think. Because I was probably at a point where I was thinking, I need to meditate more. I need to get out of my brain. Um, but to be able to do a balance of Adam, you know, meditation and actually use my brain as a tool again has been refreshing. And I think, um, I think that's a, a big part of why a lot of people join is seeing Richard at work and going, okay, I can use my brain too. There's part of my brain that, that is really enjoying this and I need to um, level up and try and use it like the way he does. He makes hard concepts very accessible. And I think that overall he's made, like I say, I think he's made the platform um, very, it, you, it's very doable. You're able to overcome any obstacles time-wise, money-wise. I, I think he's very flexible and made it very, very doable for someone mm-hmm. to get in and start learning and growing. I really like how he uh, uses a lot of metaphors and um, uh, stories and uh, provides a different uh, vision, a different perspective on how to see things. He's really understanding. He's, um, he speaks to you where you are. And even if you're, you're starting off and you're, you're, you're not in a place close to where he is, He's still, he's been there. He's done that. So he can offer you some perspectives. that's going to help you see things where you are. He went from like, what the hell am I going to do to keep a roof over my head? And I have all these things I'm interested in and I want to dig into them to not only doing that and figuring out how to make his money at it, but figuring out how to share it with other people. Just his teaching style alone is probably the the most valuable part of the course and uh i just have the utmost respect and gratitude for it he just really is a genuine down-to-earth individual um who really looks to help people improve themselves if you show up for yourself if you show an attitude of gratitude richard's gonna see that and he'll he'll look after you and you, you want richard grove in your corner if it when it comes to progressing you know developing as a person and growing and becoming uh, an entrepreneur and becoming autonomous